this is a business for me and I always, and they don't always like it when I remind them that this is a business, mm -hmm. but I do. And if that loses me some, that's fine. Mm -hmm. Like when I do dick rates, I don't pretend that I'm all turned on by seeing dicks. I don't push the dick rates. I'll do it. How honest are you about the dick rates? I'm very honest because first of all, what I always say is I say, first of all, it's a keeper because they all are, because what are you going to do? And that's part of me being older is just like, this is silly. And I tell them it's yeah. silly that you're asking me to rate your dick. There's nothing that you can do for it. Number one, what's more important is the man attached. Oh, I do the same thing. Cause yeah. I would rather be with a guy yeah. with a substandard penis. Cause like, I know what a good penis is. Sure. But it doesn't matter if you're a jerk. Yeah. I don't care. A nice dick attached to a jerk is still a jerk. Right. Yeah. yeah. It's like, I mean, you know, you give me a geek with a little penis, I'm fine with that. Because if he makes me laugh mm -hmm. and he makes me feel good about myself and he's reliable, because I'll tell you what, to me, especially being older, especially being a mom, the most sexy thing you can be in my life as a man is be reliable. Do what you say you're going to do. <laughs> I, know. I feel you so hard on that. Oh, my right? God. Like. One of my favorite things, you know, people ask me, what do I love the most about my husband? And, you know, there's a lot of, like, great things about him. But, like, for me, it really is that he's just, like, a good man and he's solid and he does what he says he's going to do. Yeah, you can depend and he, on him. And I can depend on him. And he, like, will follow through on stuff and he'll do stuff for my mom and he'll take care of our daughter and, like, just these these things, you know. Like, oh, my God. That's just – it's. It's everything. Right. And then you talk about a dick and it's kind of like, I don't know. Can you rate my toe? I mean, it doesn't matter. <laughs> yeah. You know, it doesn't matter. I, oh my gosh, the one thing though, I had the, so I'm very honest and I don't pretend I'm getting turned on by seeing it. I do. I'll be like, well, here's the deal. Like, you know, you, your, your, your strong suit is your girth. You know, like I'll say like the girth is really good. Not so much length. But then I'll say, this is the ups and downs. I always go to the manscaping. Mm -hmm. um, I'll say yeah, like, if you need to do that, I will always bring that up or I'll be like, you know, nicely done. But as a woman, I don't know, you're a photographer. So maybe you do this too. I look at their surroundings. Oh my God. Yes. A hundred percent. I'll be like, you might want to pick that joint up a little bit. Like yeah. I'll notice like dirty clothes oh, or whatever. Yeah. And, and I tell guys this all the time. And it's so funny because I've had this conversation with so many other women who also do dick ratings. Yeah. Like the environment is very important. Yeah. We look at that. If your room is a fucking mess, yeah. if it looks like you haven't done your laundry <laughs> or like washed your bed sheets, I'm not even getting into that room for you to even be able to pull your dick out. I'm not seeing like, your dick. We're never going to get to that point. Right. So pick up your fucking room. Yeah. Yeah. And I'll, well, I, even as somebody that is, is um, professionally trained at looking at dicks. Um, <laughs> even I am distracted by stuff in the background. I'll yeah. be like, oh my God. Or I'll be like, oh, well, that's nice. You yeah. know? But, and the funny ones, how about the guys that just pull it out of whatever they're wearing? Yeah. Like they pull it out of their shorts or whatever. And it's just like, okay. or they're on the toilet. Oh, God. Why yeah. would you do that? Why? To us. Like, I know you're <laughs> taking a shit, dude. <laughs> Right. Why? Yeah. But yeah, you're right. Even I, there was one guy who sent me one and he had like a guitar in the background and he had like okay, a, that's he had like right? a CD collection and I was like, oh, you're a musician, you know? And then I think about like, after we have sex, maybe you'll like play me a song, like See? stuff like that. Because that's the difference between women and men. Yeah. That's the difference. And this is what I point out to them. I'm like, listen, your dick size. <sighs> I mean, it matters. It mattered when I was hiring porn stars yeah. to some degree, you know, it, it, that it matters, matters when you're cultivating a fantasy. It matters when you're doing business. Right. But these guys are not asking, well, some of them are asking if they could be a porn star, but I think a lot of them just want to know, like, could I satisfy a woman? Am I right. good enough? Am I good enough? Well, a lot of these dick pic ratings say to me is, am I good enough to be worthy of love? Right. Or am I going to be, are they going to make fun of me when they see my dick? Yeah. And I mean, I've only seen one where I was like, wow, that's a, that's a gorgeous dick. Was mm -hmm. it the guys? I don't know. But, um, and I've only seen a couple where I'm like, oh, that's unfortunate, but I hope he can, <laughs> I hope he can go down on the woman. <clears throat> and that's the other thing. Mm -hmm. If a guy has good oral skills. Yeah. Again. Yeah. Cause a lot of us, oral skills, a lot of us can't come from penetration. 
I'm one of them. Just who I honestly, as a woman of this age, I don't know who can't, who doesn't need at least some clitoral stimulation as well. Mm -hmm. Hey guys, if you want to support my show, then you should think about joining my Patreon. At my Patreon, I offer all kinds of amazing perks in exchange for your financial support. From live streams of my interviews as they are happening, to bonus Q&As, behind the scenes photos and videos of my shoots, plus cool merch like stickers, mugs, and hoodies, we have you covered. So go to patreon.com slash hollyrandallunfiltered, and while you're at it, make sure that you click that subscribe button so you don't miss a single one of my new updates.